We'll look forward to seeing some of those games. As we jump right into another game here, we have Cy, who took a loss earlier versus Lockdown. Lockdown won earlier. Um, I don't know if they're still at the same year. Lockdown is still 1-0, and Cy, I'm not sure if he's still just 0-1. But we, uh, I'm guessing this is Cy on offense. Yes, because he's in the bright green. And he's in that five wide. He likes to run a lot with the quarterback, but it's to set up his routes because he has a lot of little crossing routes and things like that that he, if he gets you, your defenders running away with that, it should open up a lane for him to take off and run with. I got to say, as a Bears fan, it warms the cockles of my heart to hear somebody shout out the Bears. Yeah. Jordan Howard, an underappreciated man. Uh, maybe the, the Madden version the a little hell? more appreciated. QB sneak on first and ten. Okay, so he's just trying. He's just going Time. for the field goal. Yeah. And he's up on lockdown. So that's cool. That's cool. So it looks like early on some of these guys just getting the rust off. Um, getting you, Some guys haven't played regs in a while. Somebody sometimes some guys haven't played head to head in a while. So, you know, you, you give them that benefit of the doubt because we do have a lot of great competitors here. So we'll see how they warm up. The ones who don't have to warm up, ones who come in ready to play, they should have better seedings come later on. Oh, Ooh. and he got and he it. Covered. What? Ooh. First play of the second oh, half. Fumble wow. recovery. That on is the vicious. That hurts. Yo, that is amazing right there. Oh, my God. Woo, he almost gave it right back. Dude, that's, that's nice to play um, outside line. I'm strong safety, but I sat as an outside linebacker. And that right there, them little swing routes or flare routes to the running backs, D-backs love those routes because the, the corner, I'm sorry, the running back can't see you as you come up, and you could put hellacious hits on them. We almost saw a big fumble hit right there, but it didn't come through. Five wide again. It's probably going to take off and run. Oh, he throws to the flat, which is good. To k -Sign. that's their third running back, I believe, or car sign. Their third running back, they had. He's a he was a good fantasy player this year. Yeah, I think uh, they're talking about starting him, giving him the start, giving him the lead back role this yeah. year. He was a good player. I feel like Seahawks have been, you know, playing uh, playing roulette with their backs since Marshawn left. Yeah, they can't quite figure out one one season someone will come in in relief and light it up, and then the next they're on a different team. But the crazy thing with football right now is almost it's almost like the good teams are using committee backfields, mm -hmm. you know, Philly with LeGarrette Blunt, um, Jay Ajay and, and Clement. And then you have the Saints with uh, Kamar and Ingram, mm -hmm. you know, Coleman and, and Freeman down in Atlanta. So a lot of these teams have, have committee backfields. You do have the great backs that are still out there, the Ezekiel Alley. Oh, Jesus, I don't even know I said that. The Ty Gurley's, um, Zeke's. We're going to see Tennessee this year with uh, Derrick Henry since there's no more uh, DeMarco Murray out there. Well, they just them. brought in Deion Lewis, too. They brought Deion Lewis in. So he'll spell, he'll spell Henry just on passing downs if, if that's the case. But, yeah, it's, it's a, lot of back, a lot of shared backfields lately in football. So what are we looking at right here? Looking at here. Single back. I don't want to say ace pair, but I think that's exactly what it is. Single back wing tight. Okay. And again, we appreciate everybody who's in here. Thank you so much, Figgy. MLB Boss 49ers. Beast Mode Mac. Eagles Nation. P-Van, Pavan, saying what's up to all of you guys. We appreciate you guys coming through. User pick 4-6. So 17-3 right after the half. Mm -hmm. Because Down of that fumble. Downs. Yeah, that was amazing, man. Coming out, picking up an extra possession when you're kicking a ball off to somebody. You don't expect to get a turnover on a kickoff. So that's a great a great thing. Like, like we say, the man guys are smiling on side right now. He needs it. He took that loss early, so he needs to get one up on. He needs to get a win over here versus lockdown. That should help him out in his seeding some. 
Let's see where everybody lands out. Hit this uh, single elimination. Ooh, nice pickup. Ah, you almost got a low pass that. Make him fall down and catch that because up top, they're swatting that thing. But that was a good blitz pickup by his running back. Pass just didn't get hauled in. And I'm still waiting to see this swerve. This, um, this swerve catch everybody talking about. I'm still waiting for it. Luke Wilson, fast tight end for them, and Jimmy Graham. Two threats on the field. Ooh, that could have been picked, and it was. There it is. And it was. Take your time. Get through there. There you go. Size and control right now. Size and control. Third quarter, a minute 34 left in the game. I mean, not in the game. In a minute 34 left in the quarter. Was that into triple coverage? Yeah, it was, so he had he had a pocket open real quick, but mm -hmm. the spacing in between there wasn't – it just wasn't a smart throw. Now, he got away with it in the beginning, but because it got tipped up, for some reason the animation makes it so much easier to tip the ball this year. Mm -hmm. I mean, not tip the ball, to intercept it off of the tip. That's why they was able to get there. That's kind of hard to do in football. Catching it off of the tip is, is, is hard. Unless you swat it all the way up, then I got time to run under it. But it's still a little bit hard to do. So third and six at the 26, just outside the red zone. What is Cy going to do here? What is he going to do? He has two first downs, one he can pick up here, and then the next would be essentially the end zone. He lets it run all the way out. He takes the timeout, so he wasn't confident in his play. You're going to bunch halfback. Versus 335, more than likely is going to be that inside zone. I mean, not inside zone. That cross man is in here. So, no, I'm probably going to see some type of cover two. Let's see what we have out here. And I love this formation when you got so much on the right side, but he doesn't send that running back out. He still is able to get something out there. But if you add that running back, that you flood it way more because there's no way that you can you can defend that with a zone at all. You are you guys are watching Sai again. Sai is not again. You're watching Sai versus Lockdown. Size in green, Lockdown is in blue. You can see that on the screen. Again, we're here at Nurse Street Gamers, 908 North 3rd Street in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania at the NSG Eastern Conference Championships. What that means is there is a tournament series. This isn't just a tournament event. This is a tournament series. Madden is a part of this series, and it is a three-city tour. Philadelphia starts it off. Chicago is next. Washington, D.C. is the finals. So you guys who aren't here, you have an opportunity to get yourself out to Chicago. Make sure you register for Chicago. The finals will be held in Washington, D.C. We already had our Chicago event for uh, Counter-Strike. You had Chicago yeah. for Counter-Strike? we got a Philly event coming up, I think, sometime this summer. I don't know if dates have been announced yet. Okay. Um, Chicago was awesome. I it mean, was nice out there? Yeah, we were part of. We were with uh, CGC, which was a bunch of the fighting games. Okay. It's big Smash players. Cool. Smash players get hype. All right, They're I got to check it out. Fun to be in the building with. I'm going to look you guys up and see what that community is about. I've always been, you know, interested at, in other areas. When I um, worked with MLG, I was able to take a look at how that whole Halo crowd mm. works and the um, Call of Duty crowd works. So that was a great thing, too. And a lot of our Madden players played that game as well. So now we're talking about Counter-Strike. These guys already had these nice rigs for broadcasting and stuff. They could essentially take a look at Counter-Strike and see if you guys can compete in that. If, if they're playing for money on it, Madden players will come. <laughs> <laughs> There's lots of money. The yeah. Chicago was a 10K. Yeah. Wow. It's nice stuff. I think, uh, I think the Philly event's going to be a 10K too. See, there you go. You, got, you have to get involved. You want to be a professional gamer, you got to be able to play multiple games. We're here with our Madden players. Madden players are normally real good user 
player, so that should help work in those type of Counter-Strike or those first-person shooter games. Um, but we know those games are extremely fast as well. Um, so we'll see what's going on with that. Again, thank you guys for all coming out. We have good competition in here today. Again, you guys have Goals is here. Hollywood is here. Dubby's here. Big Gene is here. Steve-O from back in the day is out here. WBC, Washington Ballers Club. He was a member of that group. Him and Jet um, are out here. So that is a good thing. To see some old faces in here. Guys are still young. I was a little bit older than them. So they still look very young um, or looking in, in you know, look good for their age. And um, it's just good to see some of our guys out here, man. It's definitely a good thing to see. And then the new guys get a chance to see some of the vets. Vets can tell them stories about how things used to be in the past, let them know how appreci appreciative they should be about how things are uh, right now. So now lockdown is going to a spread formation. It looks like just four wide spread. And he didn't protect and took that sack. You have to, you got to lay that back in. You got to have some extra protection out there. You can be nano detected for all this and that, but you still have to have your line set for um, your protection set or you will give up a sack. That's, that's easy. I mean, at this point, 23, two minutes left in the fourth. You know he's going deep, so. Yeah, this is over. Like, T -off this, is, this is crazy. So we got to see who else is coming up if this game is pretty much in hand 20 to 3 in the fourth see who else is out here what we have coming up next for you guys i know you guys want to know what else is going on so we will definitely let you know um and as soon as i see that i will i will pass that on to you i mean at this point what he needs a hail mary a pick a, a fumble recovery on the uh or an onside kick and recovery oh Ooh. yeah he almost lost that almost cam lost chancellor there. Minute and a half, Cam fourth and four. Chancellor. So this is the last year of the Legion of Boom, you think? Oh, it's, they're done. They're done? They're done. Shipped uh, Richard off. They, yeah, Sherman they got off. rid of Sherman. I mean, you know what? You know what honestly hurt the Legion of Doom? Marshawn. Mm. Can't grind it on the ground. Dominant so, defense doesn't work as well. So here's what happens. The Ooh, picked off. Where is it? It's done. It's over. It's done. So in real.